guys. Today I'm going to read the Bible story. The Bible title is God's Wonderful Gift. The Holy Spirit comes. Jews from all over the world were in Jerusalem for the feast of Pentecost. Jesus' followers were there too. They gathered together They gathered together waiting for the gift Jesus has promised for them. So Jesus has promised one gift. So they were all waiting for the gift. In the middle of the festival, God's gift arrived. It began with the sound, a sound like a howling wind that filled the house where they were waiting. Jesus' followers were waiting in Jerusalem for the gift he had promised to send them. True or false? True. Next, something that looks like fire still on each one of them. Then God's Holy Spirit fill everyone in the room and he gave the power <coughs> to speak a different language so the disciple was there and god has given the promised gift and it was like over their head they were like lit the fire that's the spirit and they had, had the power to speak another language. Different, different language. <laughs> <laughs> everyone is surprised. Mm. Jews from other parts of the world heard them and were amazed. These people are speaking in our language, they said, and proclaiming the wonderful things God has done. So another country's like her what they can do and they were amazed so they have preached the god's word this is God's gift, Peter explained. It was a promise long ago. 
it came to us through Jesus the Messiah. You crucified him, but God brought him back to life. So they said, if this is God's gift, and it is promised for long ago, it comes to Jesus. Jesus was died, but God brought him back to life. Question were drew from other parts of the world amazed to find the disciples speaking their language? Yes, they were amazed. What should we do? The people are sadly turned away from evil, said Peter. Believe in Jesus Christ. He will forgive your sins and give the Holy Spirit. So the people were worried because they know about Jesus now. So they were worried. <gasps> what should we do? We were doing bad things. What should we do? And uh, Peter said, Go turn away from evil and believe in Jesus Christ. And then he will give you the spirit and give you the sense. So. One day, three thousand people were baptizing, and they're just the first of many people who would come to trust in Jesus as a savior. Question, how did the people show their faith after they repented and believed in Jesus? Number one, pray. Number two, teach. Number three, baptize. Number three is the correct answer. There is an activity, but I will not do it. Okay, I will do. I have almost finished, so I have to. Because I finished. Actually, I really like Armor of God, Root of the Spirit, Life of Daniel. A little salvation, shelter, faith, belt of truth, good news, shoes, shelter, sin, and. Sword of the Spirit, just I'm a living God. And it's all salvation, shield of faith. Belt of truth, good news, shoes. Sword of the Spirit, just I'm a living God. The fruit of the Spirit, fruit of the Spirit is coconut. Fruit of the Spirit is coconut. Actually, I just like this, but I was only just. Love, joy, peace, patience, kind, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. 
and Life of David. Watching his ship fight with peace David anointed to be king David please for King Saul Defeat Goliath Defeat his enemies Fields from King Saul David crowned as a king, David sang so among his war, David cried a song to God, this is the life of David. Yes, today I read the Bible story, did you like them? I am with the mystery. Did you like that? Next time I will read No Silver and No Gold. A Creeper Man is Healed. Yeah. Come on.